o'clock in the morning and have everything finished by 7 a.m. Otherwise, you'd be fined a pound. Um, there was also a retailing section there as well. Gladys Simpson. So she was the first woman in Australia. I started in tourism about five years ago and started a little tour company called Central Market Tour and that's now blown out into trips that go around South Australia to areas that you've been at, to the Murray Lands. Thank you. Uh, and my, the thing that really kicks me off is, uh, is meeting the farmers, the guys who grow the mushrooms and, and grow the lamb and you know, walking onto the farm, a bit like what you've done, you know, going out and physically doing it. So I take little trips around South Australia. Some very high end in a little plane, we do uh, Kangaroo Island, Air Peninsula and, uh, and the Barossa Valley and 
kids are. So I won't go on about me, but if you're looking for uh, little FIT trips or groups of 10, 20, uh, give me a yell. It's, I can change things really quickly. And, and if your clients are looking for a food experience that, that is not on the register through traditional tourism, give me a yell, because I can make it happen. What we're going to do for the next hour is go in here and have a look around. This is the oldest market in Australia. Uh, it's 140 years old and uh, it's the most visited destination in the whole state. And we get about a million people a month to come through the place. And uh, it's the very sort of heart of not only the food industry but also the community. So it's a real sort of meeting place. And, uh, they're all mum and dad operators. There's no franchises, no chains. Uh, and uh, and it's pretty kick ass. It's a really good spot. <laughs> Uh, into just a food quarter, I suppose is a good way to do it. 